let's start working on the basic building block for this app that is a bookmark start by creating a new class called bookmark that has two member variables title and link both of the type string as the name suggests the title variable would represent the name of the bookmark and the link variable would represent the link or URL of the bookmark. These are also called instance variables. Next, we need a constructor to initialize or create a new bookmark. Since we would always want a bookmark to have a title and a link, let's create a constructor which takes in a title and a link, both of the type string. These are called constructor arguments or constructor parameters. Once received, we can initialize the bookmark title and the bookmark link to be mapped to the constructor arguments. This can be done using the this keyword. The this keyword would represent the current bookmark object. Dart has the ability to infer types. Hence, when it is obvious what the type of a variable, field, or method is, we can omit writing it explicitly. In our case, since title and link are declared as strings in the bookmark class, we can omit the types from the constructor arguments since they are being used to initialize strings later on, so they must be of the type string themselves. This is known as type inference. The pattern of assigning a constructor argument to an instance variable is so common that Dart has some syntactic sugar to make it easy. You can initialize the instance variable in the constructor arguments themselves. This makes this whole class a lot cleaner and easier to interpret. As an example, let's create a new instance of a bookmark in this dummy widget class. Note that when we pass integer or double values as the arguments, a warning is shown since the infer type that is string is not the same as the type of the value being passed as the constructor arguments. On fixing it, this now means that the string 1, 2, 3 would be assigned to the title instance variable and the string 1, 2, dot 4 would be assigned to the link instance variable of the bookmark B. A handy way to generate this constructor automatically is to right click and click generate followed by selecting the arguments that we want the constructor to have. The same can also be done by pressing command N on the keyboard.